Hey guys, Thunderbow here, and BAM! Glowing Neon Text in Pocket Edition. How the hell did I do that? Well, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make cool glowing signs just like this. So, in order to make a glowing text thing, all you're going to need to do is make a dark room and then add some signs that have text on them. It's really simple, and uh, right here is the box that I made. I did this off camera, and um, there's nothing special about it, you know, it's just a stone box. Uh, I chose to make a 5x5 five five floor, uh, and then just build up the walls so that way when I go inside, I have enough room to jump around, so that way you can have like a 3x3 three three wall over here, so you can lay some signs across on top and bottom. So once you're inside the box, just place a torch so you can actually see, and then cover it. So now it's just a en fully enclosed box. Now go into your inventory and grab a sign. Now I'm only going to do one sign in this video, uh, because doing more than one takes like forever. In order to access colored text, um, you need to go into, at least on iOS, you have to go into the numeric pad, and then Press and hold on the AND sign until you see this S-shaped squiggle. Then move your finger over so it's pressing down on the S-shaped squiggle and let go. Now this will activate the color text and in order to get various colors you can now enter the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, or 0 or the English letters of A, B, C, D, E, or F. Either one of these letters or numbers will give you a various color. So, for example, by pressing F, now you could see the uh, key character turned white. So now I'm going to spell out my channel, and uh, I'm going to hit enter. And now I'm going to go back over here, because once you skip a line or you hit backspace, it cancels out the... Uh, the color that you're using, so you have to go back into the L to the uh, number pad, uh, press down and scroll over to the S character. Now I'm going to do red, uh, which I'm actually looking for a bright red, so I'm going to do C, which that would give me a rose-like red. Now I'm going to do in all caps is, now I'm going to go to the next line, and I'm going to go back to the AND button, scroll over to the S. Now I'm going to do a letter B, which will give me bright blue text. I'm going to spell out thunder. Now I'm going to go back over here, go to the S, and type in 6, which gives me yellow. Well, it's actually like a golden yellow. And then I'm going to go back over here, get the S, and I'm going to type in, I think it's E. Yeah, so that's going to give me a bright yellow. Uh, so now I'm going to skip a line, and now I'm going to do the S thing again, now I'm going to type A, and that's going to give me bright green text, and I'm going to spell it subscribe. And then I'm going to do, actually, why did I do that? I should just do all yellow. So we're going to type in E again, colon, smiley face, and you can close out, and the sign is done. So you can see it has the various colors, white in my channel, red in is, thunder and bright blue, golden bow, uh, bright yellow in 98, and the smiley face and bright green in subscribe. So now to view your colored text in the dark and make it glow, all you have to do is remove the torch, look up, and there is your colored text that glows. So this is perfect for adventure maps that you're trying to make like in the dark mazes and you have to like follow the signs. Uh, I can see this being used as people's channel outros, which as a matter of fact, I'm probably gonna start doing that because if you guys saw in my other uh, setup that I made, it had thanks for watching and then my, all my channel info on either side. So. Uh, I'm probably going to use that as a temporary channel outro because it looks really cool and it's super awesome. So if this helped you guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Also like this video if you found it interesting, subscribe for more Pocket Edition content, and I will see you guys next time.